you both campaigned pretty loudly for Obama. Are you happy with how he's got on? Yeah, I am. Uh, you know, I think he walked into a really, really turbulent situation. And I think he, uh, you know, I think as a young politician, he sort of probably made some statements and took some stands and said, we're going to do this and we're going to do this. And he got people so rallied up behind it um, and, then, and, then, and then met and realized there's a very serious opposition, which is, which is, you know, the other half of the country that has a, a very different opinion. Negotiation is always about, uh, you know, uh, about giving up on, on something. You know, at, at some level you have to say, what am I willing to give up in order to achieve what I want to achieve? Mm -hmm. And, you know. and looking at the big picture. I mean, look, it's, I, th I, I think that in certain ways um, they weren't going to allow him to win. And so I think he's faced, I think he came into something turbulent, and I think he's also faced a, a, a lot of, of, of opposition to, you know, positive changes. Um, that said, he's a human being, and nothing, um, and no human being is, is perfect. And uh, he also stepped into a Sisyphean task. I mean, the, the, the economic ball was rolling down the hill, right? And one guy is not going to be able to, you know, stand in front of that ball and, and move it back uphill. And, and I would say if, if, if you're a supporter or you're not, stop asking the president to do the job because we need to do the job. 